ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another review by Project Time Psycho again with you today. And in this one, we're gonna go through the fourth part of the Guardians of the Galaxy Telltale series. Um, so let's just get on to it. Um, the fourth part is titled Who Needs You and is still, well, a classic Telltale style game with a comic book look and everything in which your decisions impact the whole storyline with some point and click um, actions that you can do throughout the story that m make you progress through it a bit more um, a bit more fluidly and not just listen to the story and respond to the uh, the characters and shape out the story how you would like it to so let's just get on to the um, well the story of the fourth part. Um, in the previous part, we actually had the choice to empower or destroy the Eternity Forge, in which the all of the other Guardians were pretty much divided on um, right before Hala um, arrived to try and claim it for herself. So, we continue on from that one. Um, with the fate of the Eternity Forge uh, and all of the Guardians uh, more divided than ever, you as Star-Lord are pretty much uh, trying to hold the team together um, and kind of get to a solution which would befit all of them, but um, that pretty much is not possible. Um, while doing that, Hala destroys the temple and traps all the whole team in the caves below it, um, and as they evade the threat of a rockworm hive, um, you as Star-Lord are pretty much shown uh, Drax's past by Mantis on accident, we're gonna, I'm gonna have to mention that, on accident, um, and learn about Drax's daughter's death and that he still blames himself for it. Um, after that, you pretty much manage, um, all of you pretty much manage to escape the caves and return to the Milano, but um, it's not going to be that easy because you are swallowed by a massive rockworm, um, forcing the whole team to make some painful sacrifices in order to escape. And um, with that, the relationships between them um, divide even more and the whole team kind of breaks apart. Uh, that's pretty much where the episode ends in this one, um, and needs to continue on uh, in the final part. So, I'm gonna recommend this game to all of you guys who love the story parts of the game, because, um, because the Telltale games are pretty much based on the story and your decisions that impact it uh, throughout everything. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be pretty much all from my side for this one. In the meantime, don't forget to like and subscribe, comment on the videos, and I'll be joining you in the next one.